Was he to you a great songwriter from the beginning or did he just develop into one? Did you know right away how great of a songwriter he was or did it come with time? <clears throat> when I auditioned for the band and first heard the band, like Eric and I were in a band be way before Warrant, like a year or two, maybe before Warrant started and or maybe it was a year. Um, but when I first saw Eric ran back into Eric and they were looking for a guitar player, I went and listened to some music with Eric because they were looking, you know, Janie wanted a new lead guitar player. And I went in and some of the tunes I heard were tunes that he hadn't written that the, that the old guys in the band had written that, that him and Steven had replaced right mm -hmm. with Jerry and Eric and they were okay. You know, um, Janie's, I did hear down boys. And that's a song I auditioned on was Down Boys. That's one of them, one of the three. And then Heaven. So once I got in the band and I started watching how he worked, yeah, I, you know, and then once it got to the point where we were recording our first two records, you know, and he came in with stuff and the way that we worked and the way that it ended up on records, it was amazing, amazing talent, you know, um, lucky to have a guy like that that's that talented that's a wordsmith like that he read a lot so that's why the lyrics are a lot deeper than a lot of other bands yeah um, that's why you get that's why you get tunes like mr rainmaker or 30 yes. in a raggy jar you get they're little they're really little stories so every song's a little story was a little story to him and and uh yeah you're right he was amazing you know he is he is missed um more than people can understand you know we we are a pretty private band and uh that's you know we'll just tell you we miss him we love him it's a shame you know